in case this happens to be your first time please do me a favor to make sure you subscribe now in case you don't know alien thompson hera is the fastest woman alive and guess what a lot of athletes are actually afraid of Ellen Thompson Hira, but they will not come publicly and declare that they are afraid of Ellen Thompson Hira simply because it is not supposed to be so. But a lot of athletes are actually afraid of Ellen Thompson Hira because Ellen Thompson Hira, the fact about her is that once she is healthy, once she is fit, once she is ready. She is ready. And trust me, she is going to deliver. If Ellen Thompson Hira is properly trained, then believe me, she will always win any race. The fact that she has the fastest time in the whole wide world is a proof that she is the main athlete to break the Flojo world record. Although the Flojo world record has a lot of controversies. I have heard a lot of people saying that the Flojo world record is actually a fake record concerning the fact that um, she was not taught, she there were not developed machines that could test human uh, human's body back then in the 1990s. And a lot of people are feeling like Ellen Thompson Hira should have been given the world record already in the 100 meter. The fact that she is very hard working. Now, I made this video because I feel like Ellen Thompson Hira is not ordinary. Now, the reason I said Ellen Thompson Hira is not ordinary is because let's take a look back at the Diamond League final. Ellen Thompson Hira beat Shakari Richardson, and Shakari came fourth position instead of third. This is to tell you that Ellen Thompson Hira is going to be a powerhouse in Paris Olympic and I do believe she's going to take the double double which means the 100 meter gold and the 200 meter gold. I feel like nothing is going to step, stop Ellen Thompson Hira from doing that. The fact that she has both experience, she has the experience from Steven Francis Fano and her new coach um, Ronald Walcott and also don't forget that earlier this year um, Kishani Thompson the female sprint um, coach from Jamaica also coached Ellen Thompson Hira so imagine three experience from different coaches all in the same body of Ellen Thompson Hira and imagine an athlete that was being trained within one month and an athlete who went from getting last position in 2023 in the jamaican national trials and she went from getting third position in diamond league final within a couple of weeks a month isn't this amazing isn't this to isn't this a sign? Isn't this a warning that Shelly and Fraser of Rides, Sherika Jackson, Shakari Richardson are in damn trouble? They are in big trouble. Let me know what you think in the comment section.